I've traveled to more than 150 countries around the world, and the one thing I really love doing is finding alternate ways of getting around. And Wales certainly has those kinds of experiences, from steam-powered trains to the world's highest canal ride. When you travel through Wales, it's not about getting from point A to point B. It's about the journey itself. I'm Peter Greenberg, and I'm about to show you some of my hidden gems of Wales. One of the best known ways to travel through Wales is on a vintage steam train. And I'm talking vintage. In fact, the first steam locomotive was built in Wales in 1805. And the best part? You can still catch a ride on lines like the Langothlin Railway in Northern Wales. While the Langothlin Railway may be better known, what isn't well known is that the train station offers more than just a scenic ride. Wow. Did you ever fantasize as a kid about becoming a train engineer? Well, guess what? In Wales, you can do it. The Langothlin Railway will actually train you to become an engineer, and you drive one of these things over its entire 15-mile route. And believe me, it's all real. It's hot up here, but guess what? This works, too. How'd I do? Very good. Those who know me best know that I'll use just about any possible excuse to get out into the water and onto a boat. And Wales has boating experiences unlike any other place I've ever been, like riding on a horse-drawn boat. It may look a bit odd, but horse-drawn boats have been used in the United Kingdom since Roman times. During the Industrial Revolution, millions of tons of cargo were moved with horsepower, literally. One horse can pull over 25 tons. Now, there are canal boat rides, and then there are canal rides along the longest and highest aqueduct in Britain. More than a thousand feet long, the aqueduct at Ponta Casilta is one of the only navigable aqueducts in the world. This iron giant was created by Thomas Telford and took more than 10 years just to design. You can cross the waters of this architectural marvel in a motorized boat I've got a question for you. Are you prone to seasickness? Are you afraid of heights? <laughs> Have I got a boat ride for you. Above this aqueduct built in 1850, we're 126 feet above the ground. And the coolest thing about this is that these canals go for another 45 miles. Talk about a boat <laughs> with a view. And just like everything else in Wales, it's not your typical experience. I'm Peter Greenberg. Thanks for watching.